everyone, this is Rachel Perry with the Tag Team and business partner of Amanda Holland. I'm going to show you how you can create an event for your Facebook show on Facebook. So, what you do on you, this is your home page, and we come in and we go over to events. And your events page might look something like this, or it might look something like this. I'm currently enjoying this look. Um, I hacked into Amanda's account the other day and discovered that this is how she had it and sort of liked it. Just kidding, I didn't hack into it, I had permission. Um, but anyway, um, or you can do it like this. For the, um, the sake of this example, I think I'm gonna just keep it like this. Now, you'll see that I have some already. Um, this is kind of what our Jammies and Jewels show looks like, the invitation. Um, so I am going to go back and um, show you how to actually create it. So you go up to the top and it says create event. We're going to name this. We're going to call it jammies and jewelry. And if I could spell that would help. Now for your details, you want it to sound fun. You want it to express that it's fun, fast, and easy. I, for all of my invitations, basically copy and paste the same verbiage. So I um, just copy it and now I'm pasting it in, in here. Um, you want to make sure that you go in and change the date because that's just what you need to do. Anyway, then we go to add the place where, well guess what, it's right here on Facebook. Ha, la. Okay, um, or you can put on your couch, on your bed, on the roof, whatever. Um, then you pick a date. We're going to say that it's um, on the 30th, and we're going to say all of ours are at 9 p.m. It's just easier that way. That's kind of like when everyone has their kids in bed, um, they can get in their PJs and relax for the night, um, and there's often a lot of, um, I guess, movement on Facebook at that time. Then you can put an end time. Make sure you change the date because oftentimes it comes up the next day, and um, I'm not going to be up till you know, 12 a.m. Well, actually, I might be. Okay, so we're going to make it 9.30. Now, this next part is probably the most important part, if you ask me, um, and it's privacy. You don't, you don't want it to say friends. You want it to be private. So put down invite only. When you click on that down arrow, it brings up a menu, public friends, invite only. Click on invite only, and here's why. If it doesn't have invite only, Everyone in your news feed is going to see every single comment that people make. They're going to see every, and you know what, when you're posting things, that can get really annoying to people that aren't invited to the show. So you want to make sure that it's invite only. Now, then you hit create. The problem with this now, you're going to look at it and see that it's only by Rachel Perry. Well, Rachel Perry is me, duh. And I am kind of the rep for, for the company, okay? I'm the jeweler in this situation. So I don't see the name of the hostess on there. Well, that's because you have to add her. So you go to edit. So we went back to edit. Let me just show you again. We go up to edit. I don't know why Facebook does this, but for some reason they do. And then we're going to go ahead and click in another person's name. So in this situation, I'm going to put Amanda Holland. And if you see here, it says hosts will be added after they join this event. So once she joins it, she will then automatically be up there and it will say Amanda Holland is one of the hosts, okay? Right now she hasn't said yes, but soon she will. So we have the event created. Um, I like to add a picture just because it makes it look prettier um, and I just think visually it's more exciting and I don't know. So I'm going to add just a random picture. I had one in my library. You don't have to have that. If you don't have one on your computer, you can go to Google Images or something. Um, so I just, I just did that. Oh look, Amanda's now coming. So you'll see down here in the notifications that um, the person has decided that she is going to come and so soon. Um, she will show up as um, the host. In fact, let's refresh this and see what happens. And now you can see that she's also a host. And then what Amanda can do is Amanda can go up here to invite friends and then invite all of her friends, okay, whoever she wants to invite. So that's how that works. And now you have your Facebook show invitation ready to go. 
Um, and you can, oh look, <laughs> Amanda wrote, oh my gosh, totally there, what a great idea. Um, and you will get people like that. So how's that for a tutorial? My very first tutorial ever on the computer. I hope you all enjoyed it. Um, check us out, tag team on Facebook. Peace out, fools.